Alright, what's going on guys, it's Hijinx Gaming, and today I start the first episode of my series, Road to Max Town Hall Level 8. So as you can see here, um, this is my base, I'm currently upgrading my two mortars and also one of my air defences. I've already done one of my mortars, which is good, I'm just really concentrating on the splash damage defences, because that's the most important, and then I'm probably going to move on to my cannons and archers, archer towers and then I'll just move on to the other stuff like hidden Teslas but yeah I think this series should take either uh, about two months or a month I've been on Town Hall level 8 for about a week or two now and it's going pretty well um, I'm just trying to concentrate on them defences as you can see but yeah I've changed my base up recently this is a base from I think Chief Pat but I got the base design off of um, BJ can dives um, best farming bases on Town Hall level 8 because my old base just really wasn't doing it for me I kept getting my loot stolen which is never good but um, yeah that's basically it for my base um, you can also join my clan if you want it's not my actual clan but I've been in it for a while uh, rebels 32 they donate well and yeah I've, it's a really loyal clan but basically I'm going to quickly show you a quick attack I do. I was really happy with it. Um, I managed to get a lot of gold and elixir. And I also come away with 25 trophies which is good. Um, I was, yeah I was really surprised that I did this well. Because it was quite a strong base for the troops that I had. But I think my um, strategy was good. So I managed to get 100%. I start off with just putting some barbarians and archers down. Just to get rid of... Um, the air defense and some of the barracks and elixir collectors but then I follow by putting my giants down and my healers then I put down some wall breakers to try and get through as much as walls as possible but they're just going for the defenses the cannons my barbarian king goes down and eventually I put a healing spell down for my giants then followed by a rage spell to try and speed them up and get them through them walls as quick as possible so I can get into the inner of the base um once they get through i put down my clan castle troops which i had a level i think it was a level three dragon and i also put my dragon down on the right of the base just to try and take out the army camps and some of the outer defenses but as you can see here i'm inside the base um i'm doing really well um my dragon is getting affected by the rage spell and so are my archers which is really helping me out i'm pretty much destroying the whole base and I've so far I've got 190,000 gold and 68 elixir and 29 dark elixir. Um, they're just working through the base at the moment, and that was pretty much it. My two dragons pretty much just finish it off, just get rid of them last defenses. And my barbarian king is also helping out, but th yeah, that's pretty much it for that raid. I'll just speed it up a bit. And after this I'll have another raid to show you, it's not as good as this one, but I do manage to get some, uh, a, quite a fair bit of gold and a fair amount of elixir. But yeah, this is basically it for this raid, my goblins just come in to get rid of that collector and my dragon just finishes it off. I'll speed it up for you now. And yeah, that was pretty much it for that raid. I managed to get 260,000 gold, 166 elixir, 29 dark elixir, and 25 trophies, which is always good. I, tr I try to get as much trophies as I can. I'm farming, but that doesn't mean you should get trophies because you want to keep the trophy count up. But yeah, this is the next raid I do. This one was nowhere near as good because inside the clan castle, they had, I think it's either a level 3 or 4 dragon. So I really struggled with it. But I've put my giants down, i put some archers down, and also wall breakers to get through the first wall. Um, my archers are just trying to get rid of some of the outer defences, the hidden Teslas, and the cannons and wizard towers. But my dragons have gone down from my clan castle, I think it was a level 2 dragon. And also, my I think I have a dragon, yeah I have a level 1 dragon. But they have pretty good air defences, so they are going to struggle. But I put down my rage spell to help out the rest of my troops to try and get through that wall and get to the center of the base as quick as possible. My goblins are going for the the third walls just to try and get inside and get them resources. 
but when once they get through, they manage to steal a fair amount of gold, which is good. Um, my Barbarian King is just working on the left, trying to get some of them collectors. And also, my Dragon is working on the outside, getting the collectors. Um, but as you can see, I'm um, managing to get a fair amount of gold from uh, both the collectors and the storages. Um, I'm at 140,000 gold and 50,000 elixir, and also 90 dark elixir. Um, I'm on one star at the moment, but yeah, that's it. I'll get a second star, which is good. And my Barbarian King was just finishing off there with the storages, and now he's going on the outside to just get some collectors. Um, that was it for that raid. I managed to get 180, I think that's 8,000 um, gold, 86 elixir, and 94 dark elixir. I also managed to get 10 trophies, which is always good. So that was it for that. Um, I'm just going to take you back to my base now and talk you through my plans um yeah so basically what i'm really wanting to do in is also start a let's play episode where i start from town hall level one i discussed this yesterday in my introduction but i'm just making it um official now so it's going to probably be starting within this week um and i'll be really happy to get it out and i hope you'll be happy to see it also um, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like, it would mean a lot, comment your opinions and any ideas you have, and also subscribe to me, that would mean loads. Also, you can follow me on Twitter at hijinxgaming underscore, and keep updated with all my new videos and other stuff I like to share. So, thanks a lot guys, and I'll catch you later.